healthy. But at this point, with what you've seen out of Will, and especially after a road environment last night, are you ready to name him maybe your starter? No, I'm not ready to do that yet. Um, I think we'll have a conversation with the depth chart over the weekend, and we'll have a depth chart uh, or something close to it available and when we talk to you on Tuesday to, to be able to, to go through the moving parts of not only Ryan's health, but whatever there are going on in the offensive line, which which there is, you know, coming out of that game, um, which there would be like in the defensive secondary. So there'll probably be some some moving parts here over the weekend. Again, when, when we lose, no, nobody did a good enough job. I think there was some 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 good plays. I think that there was some some decisions that that we can't make and you know, throwing the ball into cover two uh, down the sidelines isn't something that is going to be very advantageous offensively if you're trying to take care of the football. Well, no, they got the edge twice, right? There were two big ones on the edge. Uh, they, they had two uh, 15 and a 14 uh, that, that hit up the middle. So you know, sometimes what happens is it's like, okay, I got to try to make a play and I, and I peek inside or I get a little too tight or I get knocked out of my gap and then I got to show back up uh, instead of looking, you know, instead of playing the block, sometimes you look for the football uh, as opposed to just playing the block and, and knowing exactly where the ball's going based on what they're blocking and how they're blocking you. So a lot of it is, is fundamental and, uh, you just you have to be committed to, to doing it. You know, guy blocks you, you gotta block out, limit the space, right? <clears throat> guy flashes, guy pulls, you gotta fit the run, you gotta go spill, you gotta hold up on a double team. That that's what happens. It's well, not all those things. So. Before we start yelling at each other, go ahead, Joe. I was gonna say so more freelancing than there you well, I don't wanna say like paper. freelancing. It's just you can't really, I try to, I mean, I could go through one by one every double digit run. And so whether that's a freelance, somebody being in the wrong spot, uh, somebody getting, you know, just blocked, right? They, they block you. Somebody getting knocked over on a double team, uh, us not fitting a gap scheme, somebody needing to spill, not getting it spilled. Um, whether it's a toss crack and somebody's got to get up and in and somebody's got to overlap or miss tackle. Those, there's, there's a lot of those just things that come up. Um, so I would just wouldn't say that it's one particular thing based on the multitude of answers that I try to give you. Because how do you not talk more about the offense's inefficiency to get touchdowns and focus so much on the defense when they're only giving up twenty? Because I know what it's supposed to look like, in, you know, in all three phases. And um, again, in that particular situation felt like, we all felt like, um, made a bad decision to go to hop on, on first first down, uh, missed, missed Tajay, you know, on second down. And instead of um, making, making uh, what would have been a, a, a costly mistake, I felt like taking the lead on the road and ensuring that to happen on third and 10 was uh, was the right decision, and so that again you can say you know, settling for for not scoring touchdowns, but just trying to weigh you know, the best way to try to win a football game. The, the best way that I felt like at that time, based on the circumstances, based on how the game was going, you know, there was other times we get the ball on the nine yard line, and we gain five yards on first down. Probably if Derek Stiff Arms is the guy, we probably score. We gained two yards on, on second down and ultimately scored on, on third down. But there were four, three plays of at least what you would call uh, efficiency. And again, they weren't at the end of the half. You know, so now you're, you know, sitting there you know, in, the, in the mid red or high red with third and 10. And I just felt like that was what was best for us at that time.